welcome to another episode of Watch Once Over. My name is Big E, and today we're going to be looking at this beautiful Laco Pilot Watch. Now, this is the Wynn Herb Strup, and this watch goes for $23.50, and it's at azfinetime.com. It's in stock now, and the reason why I'm showing you this on my wrist is because it has this bracelet that is mm, a little difficult to put on on, on camera. And it is unique. And let's um, start off with the bracelet on here because the bracelet is different. It is a closed looped pilot type strap, um, something like they would have wore in World War II. Now, you have the logo Laco branding on here on the side. And you have a riveted type bracelet. And this bracelet looks really worn and really old, although it is brand new. And by saying it's a closed loop, as you can see, you can't take this out of here. It's it's just like that. It's closed loop. But it's extremely high quality, and it's a 20 millimeter logo opening size. And that's one of the most unique things about this watch is the bracelet. But continuing on that uniqueness is the watch itself. Now... Let's look deeper on this dial. This dial is patina, and it's supposed to look like a very old World War II type pilot's watch. Now, despite looking like a manual wine watch with the big crown, this is an automatic, and it um, has a ETA 2824-2 in here that is tuned up by Laco, and it runs extremely well, chronometer specs. Unsigned crown onion type crown unsigned dial really pulled back really plain and then this case has a special treatment on there and I believe this is a level two treatment you can get level one level two or level three of patina and I believe this one is a level two you can see the serial numbers on the side it looks like the case was cracked open a couple times here but that's how it's supposed to look this is purposely done this way i'm not trying to push off an old watch on somebody this is this watch is all done up this way and it's supposed to look like this it's supposed to look like it came from world war ii and it does now getting to the case back i don't want to take the strap off it has the low the low uh lack of um serialized numbers of what model and everything is on there it's a Flieger watch Laco, and um, the serial numbers and uh, things of that nature on there on the closed case back uh, nothing fancy on there but it, the back is also treated in that special process um, where it looks really aged and this watch is brand new um, uh, despite looking that old once again now, this is the FLD dial, and for those who are in the know, that means it's a fully loomed dial, and this thing glows like the Dickens. It has layers upon layers of Superluma, a uh, C3 Superluminova on this B-style configuration dial, and it is just fabulous. I'm going to light it up now with this torch. Then I'm going to cut the lights. It's so bright, it looks like it wants to wash out my lens. Let's go full dark. That is your full dark right there. Laco B style dial. And as you can see, this thing just glows like the Dickens. And I like the way it looks like a wind up watch, but it's an automatic. So it has no date. So you have that real great grab and go aspect on this one and i'm really seriously considering adding this particular watch to my collection um at 23.50 but i believe it is a great price and i like it and this also won a design award in uh 2015 so it it is a really groovy watch it's something different 
something like I've never handled and seen before, but um, I'm thinking about it. Uh, let me know if I should pull the trigger, guys. That's the watch once over for today. You can pick this up at azfinetime.com. My name is Biggie, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Have a good day. God bless.